Good morning, everyone. This is Mr. Lowe uh, coming to you live from Friday. Uh, but anyway, today's lesson on hands-on equations. So right now, all I want you doing is watching the board, paying attention so you understand what we are doing today. Today is lesson eight, level one. And for lesson eight, we get introduced to this person right here. His name is Star. There's a couple of different ways we can write it. We can write star just like that as a star, or most of the time in hands-on equations, you will see it written just like that. So star is very similar to the blue pawn, which we called x. Uh, there are some slight subtle differences, and we'll talk about those as we progress. But for now, let's take a look at what we have. So if I have a problem up on the board that says 2 times 3 star plus 1 equals 2 star plus 10. What I want to do is get 3 star plus 1, but remember, I want it 2 times. So I'm taking this uh, parentheses here and I'm doubling what I see on the inside of it. So instead of 3 star, I now have 6 star. And I have 6 star plus 2. And I'm taking all of that, putting it up on my left side of my equation. And then I have 2 star plus 10. Now, once we get the setup, everything else about hands-on equations in lesson 8 is exactly the same as what we've done in the previous lessons. So I have over here 2 stars. I have over here 6 stars. I could take away two stars from both sides of my equation. And I could do that because I can. And now I have two ones which equal the number two. So I bring those down. And I subtract two from ten. Ten minus two is eight. Now it's really simple, the same exact stuff we've been doing. I have four star equals Eight. And if 4 star equals 8, that means one of those stars has to be a 2. The way we do that mathematically, remember boys we and girls, we divide both sides of our equal sign by our coefficient, which is the number 4. So I divide this side by 4, and I divide this side by 4. 4 divided by 4 is 1. 1 times star is star all by itself. And star equals 8 divided by 4 is 2. Now, we got to do our check. We can't forget our check. We do the check the same way. So I'm going to plug in a 2 here and a 2 here. This is 3 times 2, which is 6. 6 plus 1, which is 7. And 7 times 2 is 14. And on the right side, I have 2 times 2 is 4. Plus 10 is 14. So I have 14 check 14. Let's go ahead and do another example, just so I think you guys can make sure you understand exactly what it is that you're doing. So on your board, please, I would like you to place 5 star minus 2 star equals star plus 8. So you're doing this problem just as I'm doing it, so make sure you have your white pawns out. Those are the stars. And make sure you have your red cubes out. So we're doing 5 star. So I'm going to take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 star minus two stars, I take two stars off, equals star plus eight. Now I subtract exactly like I've been doing. I have three stars on this side, I have one star on this side, I can take away one star, or subtract one star from both sides. Now that leaves me with two star equals eight, divide by your coefficient, which is two, divide both sides by two, that leaves me with star equals 4. We're going to plug in a 4 here and a 4 here. 5 times 4 is 20. 2 times 4 is 8. 20 minus 8 is 12. And 4 plus 8 is 12. So my check is 12, check 12. Again, make sure you're checking both sides of your equal sign to make sure that you get it right. Because if your checks don't work, then your x or your star is not correct. Let's try one more example, and then I'm going to give you time to work on lesson 8 in class. The example we have is 3 plus 2 star. The number 3 
plus two stars equals two stars two star minus star plus four and again let's take away what we can take one star from both sides because I can subtract three from my left side subtract three from my right side four minus three is one that leaves me with star equaling one and I plug in a one here and a one here and a one here two times one is two three plus two is five and you'll notice I go and check the other side I don't assume that one is my correct answer two times two is four or no two times hello get that one right there Mr. Lowe two times one is two minus one is one plus four is five and five check five okay all right you guys you have ten problems to do if you finish um, if the netbooks are in my room you may uh, go on to SumDog or cool math after you finish your ten problems for lesson eight make sure that uh, you guys uh, turn in lessons seven and eight together those two are due at the end of class today lessons seven and eight all right you guys uh, enjoy your day with mr keith have a good day